Lloyd. I promise to always love and support you. I promise to care for you when you are sick or when you have a bad day. I vow to always have your back and value our love. I promise to raise a loving family with you to cherish together. I promise to not only do the things we love, but also do those that you love. Lastly, I vow to be by your side for better, for worse, to love and to cherish till death do us part. Love that. That's beautiful. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Madeline, I vow to always love you, push you, support you, and inspire you. I want to share the rest of my life with you because you are my Melvin to his <laughs> piggy, <laughs> the S to my B, the Rachel to my Ross. Aww and the Romeo to my Juliet. <laughs> I promise to love you to the moon and Burke. <laughs> to always be by your side and to walk Melvin, <laughs> our love child, every morning. <laughs> well, do you do that? <laughs> With all my love, more than you know. <laughs> Me. I love you. I love you. <laughs> You know, I could spend a lot of time talking about Maddie and Lloyd, and I think everybody that knows them knows that Maddie's a wonderful, intelligent person, great daughter. You know, Lloyd's just a great guy. Same thing, wonderful and intelligent. But I think the purpose of today is really the celebration of combination of two families coming together. The Burke Royston timeline begins today. And you'll be able to look back and say, Damn, it was a good combination. Maddie and I met at college orientation the summer before our freshman year at Elon. We've pretty much been best friends ever since. I remember way back when we first became friends, we talked about how neither of us had a sister. And the thought crossed my mind that if we stayed as close as we were at that moment, then maybe we'd end up in each other's wedding someday. And here we are. There's no doubt that you're a sister to me today, and more than that, a sister I look up to, and I'm just so thankful to have. My relationship with Lloyd has and always will be one of admiration. Whenever faced with a difficult decision or tough choice in life, I'll often reflect and consider how Lloyd would approach the situation. It's yet to steer me wrong. What can I say? The kid sets a pretty good example. Anywhere I've gone in life that Lloyd had already been, I was always welcomed with open arms in a warm reception, whether it be high school, college, or any social event. He continues to pave the way for myself and others close to him with his good-natured spirit. When we all first met Maddie three years ago at our Saturday family and friends gathering for Thanksgiving, she was new and unfamiliar to all of us, but it wasn't long before we realized she was pretty much the complete package of what you could ask for in a girlfriend. Beautiful, smart, well-mannered. It was a night out of Fagers Island that summer in Ocean City when I thought I knew for sure the two would end up married, early as it was and even if they couldn't see it yet themselves. Oh my gosh, you look so beautiful. I've been waiting for this all day. <laughs> You. Oh, I love you. I love you too. <laughs> you look so handsome. <laughs> I know. Oh, these just turned you out great, amazing. but look at you. Oh my gosh, you're so beautiful. <laughs> Madeline with this ring. Lloyd, with this ring, I take you for now and for always. I pledge to love you, to cherish you, and to honor you all the days of my life. All the days of my life. Madeline and Lloyd, it is with great joy 
that I now pronounce you husband and wife. Lloyd, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Mr. and Mrs. Lloyd Burke. So Maddie and Lloyd, throughout your marriage, just remember all the people that are here in this tent today are here because we support you, and we're all here because we love you both. So let's raise our glasses. Cheers to Maddie and Lloyd. I love you guys.